Hi, and welcome to today's show. We got a lot of stuff to talk about, so let's jump right into today's show. Hi, and welcome to Utah Crossbow Hunter, where, to, where today is another crossbow forum day. All right, so I guess we've got a lot to get into today. Um, I'll get into all this setup right here in just a moment. But first, if you're a subscriber, check your subscription because YouTube has been playing their games and they've been deleting some of my subscribers. So check your subscription and make sure that it is, uh, it is um, you got your subscription. And also, if this is your first time here, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Okay, so... Um, First thing we're going to talk about here is some of the upcoming programs I got coming up. And there's a, quite a few. One is the Kinetic Energy Show. Um, we're all going to be going out to the range and we're going to be taking out, say, 20, 30, 40 yards and doing kinetic energy tests. And we'll, we'll get more into that when we come to that portion of the uh, shows. Also, you may hear some background noise. It might be on my, my uh, heater kicking on. Nothing I can do about that. It's a little chilly. Uh, you might hear some airplanes and some helicopters fly over. I can't do nothing about that because it's uh, Southern, U Southern Utah University doing their flight program. They do it out here at Milford uh, Airport. <laughs> okay, so my setup. First of all, I want to say I love this or Boris Oracle X-Scope. I really, really love it. But it doesn't have one thing. Yeah, it doesn't have a recording. I wish it had a recording, but it don't. Uh, if it just, just did the video, that, that's perfectly fine with me. It doesn't have to have sound. The video's fine. But this uh, ATN scope has sound and recording it. That's why I like it. Another reason I want to go to this, that's the reason I want to go back to the scope. Now, I'm hoping with these heavier arrows, because I was shooting the 480-grain 480, 480 Evo X arrows, and they were dropping at 30 yards. So, I'm hoping when we, do, when we put the scope back on, that at further yardages, that it, it holds its... Um, I guess you get zero instead of dropping. Well, that's what we're going to find out. Uh, not today, of course. Because today, what I'm doing is I'm going to be starting with my uh, zombie slayers, getting the, uh, the speed test and the kinetic energy and the uh, momentum taken care of with, the, with these uh, arrows. And these arrows are coming in an average of 536 grains. Now, I'm using, I did an average between the non light and knock and the light and knock. Um, I just did an average. Um, to be quite honest with you, I'm not too crazy about these light and knocks. Okay? Um, the reason is, they're not very bright. They're not alpha bright. They're really not. And they're really, really hard to see. So, um, I wish they'd come out something a lot lighter. I've seen clear ones on there that had the, the light bright on there. I like those. But these ones just have the green and a little light in there. So, I don't like those very well. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to shoot four arrows for the, with the average of 536 grains. So, uh... Oh, one more thing. I got another thing I've done starting. I'm going to start building my own arrows. Um, and we'll get into more of that later, so you definitely want to subscribe for that as we get into that. So, how about we take our first shot and see where we're at. Four hundred three. Four hundred three. 
Okay, so let's put another one in. I guess we're going to do four. So that one was a non uh, lighted knock. The next two shots will be the lighted knocks. And I'm only shooting at nine yards uh, today for the uh, zombie slayer test or the speed test for these. Because I really don't have much room here. Okay. Shot number two. This again, this is the light and knock. The first one was, I think was 531. This one is 537. Four hundred one. Four hundred one. Okay. That was a bit of a delay. Okay. Because the reason I want to get the averages here is I'm going to set up two profiles, one for the zombie slayer and one for the penetrator. Because that's going to make it a lot easier when I go out to the range. Okay, this is another light of knock at four, 537 grains. And I hope I don't hit my <coughs> other arrows because that wouldn't be good. Uh, let's go right there. Four hundred one. Four hundred one. Okay. A non lighted knock at 533 grains. This will be shot number four, my final shot. All right, where am I going to go here? I'll go right there. Four hundred three. Four hundred three. Okay. So, let me grab my eyeballs. Okay, so, we have 5, 4, 0, 3, 5, 4, 0, 1, 4, 0, 1, 4, 3. So we're looking pretty good there. So we're probably looking at the average of Four oh two and the kinetic energy is a whopping one hundred and ninety-three. One ninety-one, one ninety-one, one so at one ninety-two is our kinetic energy. Okay. So I'm going to set my profile on this for the first for the zombie slayers. Then I'm going to get ready to do the, pre, uh, the pre, uh, penetrator arrows. So hang around, I'll be right back. Okay, <clears throat> so I have my zombie slayer profile set. Now, we're 
going to set the penetrator profile after we do the speed test. So, how about let's shoot an arrow? Penetrators, they're averaging about 550 grains. Three ninety-seven. Three ninety-seven. Oh, they're not off by that much. Uh, Four oh two, I think, was the first uh, zombie slayer. Three ninety-seven. So three five. Feet per second slower. All right. I don't think I've. Sh yeah, I think I have. With the new fletching on here. I think I hear the trash truck. Yep, yeah, trash truck's going to fly now. I want to be as precise as I can this time around. Well, I have been before, but I think I want to be more uh, picky, I guess you could say, this time around with this scope. Shot number three. Okay, so this will be the final shot with the penetrator. Okay, let's see what we come up with this time around. Three hundred ninety-eight. Three ninety-eight. Okay. Well, let me get my spectacles here. Okay, so we got 398, 393, 396, 397. Kinetic energy is 193, 188, 191, and 192. Alrighty, so let's take a look here. Okay, for the spreadsheet for the Predator, let's go. Okay, so the Predator, four shot average, 550. Power factor is 217. So the average speed of 396. Alrighty, and uh, kinetic energy, we're looking at about 190, okay? Alright, so let's go back and look at the 
the one I want there, and I want the Predator. Okay, let's... Oh look, go back. Let's see here, let's... Oh... When you don't use something for a while, you get, uh, you forget things. Connected... Zombie Slayer. Okay. So, what I'm going to do here. Is I'm going to email it. It's not let me do that either. Hmm. Interesting. All right. So, anyways, I got that. So I'll set my predator profile, and the next time we go out, we'll be going out to the range next day or two, and uh, setting this up, and hopefully everything's good. So. Like I said, uh, <coughs> we're going to try really hard to get this one set up. Because like I said, I like the video and audio on this. So, uh, hang around. Don't go nowhere. You guys will make sure you hit that uh, subscribe button down below. Hit that uh, all notification bell. Hit that uh, comment. Leave me a comment. Let me know what you guys think. Am I going to be still shooting low? Am I going to be high? What? Whatever. Let me know. And share this with your family, friends, and your worst enemy. Also, uh, again, thank you for watching. And remember, these episodes are dedicated to my son. And see you on the next episode of Utah Crossbow Hunter. <laughs>